we need to check ourselves mm -hmm. as a Christian. Yes. Amen. Yes. You know, I, there was an old saying that I, as we grow up as children, I always remember it. And it says, speak the truth and speak it ever. Cause it what it will. He who hides the wrong he does did, does the wrong thing still. Mm -hmm. So, when we, 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 are, we are human, we fail. Mm -hmm. That's right. But then, let us think. When we are confronted, we can say, well, okay, I've done wrong. Mm -hmm. yes, 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 and yes. God have mercy on yes. us. Yes. Amen. Okay, tonight our goal is to meet heaven. Mm. Let us not live a deceiving life. Mm. Be not deceived. God is not mocked. Whatsoever we sow, that shall be also reap. Yes. If we sow to the flesh, the flesh we reap corruption. Yes. And if we sow to the spirit, the spirit we will reap eternal life. Yes. Okay, I'm back down to my point. The first and vital piece of our armor for the Christian in spiritual warfare is truth. Yes, yes, yes. To stand strong in this battle, we must know the truth. Yes, yes. We must live by the truth. Hallelujah. Only in this way will the rest of our armor stay, stay on. And only in this way will we be protected in this Hallelujah. battle. Amen. We, we, are, we are all in a battle. Yes. We are, we, we, we're not fighting against flesh and blood, Amen. but principalities of the universe. So we need to be careful. And if truth is in our lives, or if we stand for truth, then every other part of the armor will fall Amen. in place. Yes. They said the belt of truth. Yes. So when we hold it up around our waist and we sit, you know, if you yes, look right. at the swords, the soldiers or whatever, yes, 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 yes. you know, one time I was looking at the policeman in the, in the train and I saw so many things <laughs> on that belt <laughs> and I wanted to know how it stays there. Mm. And then, you know, I think back, I said the belt of truth, yes, mm. it's there. And then so many other things can hook on there. Oh, hallelujah. And, and you think of it, when truth mm. is in, in place in our lives, mm. we would walk yes. in the way God wants us. Mm. Every mm. other mm. thing would fall into place yeah. in our lives. Beautiful. Praise God. Yeah. You know, one little lie was, was Satan used in the Garden of Eden to destroy the future of all mankind? Mm -hmm. The Bible tells us, no. Lie can destroy what God has in store for us, mm -hmm. and even our future can be destroyed by lies. Mm -hmm. Or the Bible says, all liars shall have their part in the lake of fire. Mm -hmm. And I remember there was a story in the book of Acts 5 with Ananias and Sapphira. Yes. We all know that story. Yes. When they had that portion of land and they sold it, mm. yes. they went mm. into the house of God. They bring the portion. They, the two of them mm. did what they talked their story mm. over and they hid apart, right. yeah. right. thinking that the Holy Spirit mm. would not know. Yeah. Yeah. But let us remember. Whatever we do, God sees. Yeah. God knows. If our brother or our sister don't know, God, God knows. knows. Yes. 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 So as a Christian, we need to shine our light and let the truth at all times be there, shining truth for us. Yes. Yes. So Ananias, we all know that story, how he went in first and, and he was confronted and he, he lied to the mm -hmm. Holy Ghost. Yep. And, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then yeah. after that, his wife came and the same thing. Mm -hmm. yeah. But Tom. thank God that is not in our days Ooh. because we would have done <laughs> it. <laughs>